for that perfect Valentine's Day date. Well, there's plenty to see at the movies this week. That might be a good option. Here's what's, what's new at the big screen is Fox News contributor and the founder of NerdDears.com, Kevin McCarthy, the original. Kevin, can the you original. save people? Can you save people from a boring Valentine's Day? <laughs> of course I can. Good morning to you guys. Morning, Thank morning. you for having me on as always. But what, what says Valentine's Day more than an R-rated Deadpool movie? I mean, that's, that's what I was always hoping Bacon for roses. on a Valentine's uh, Day weekend. Bacon <laughs> roses. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, and this movie, by the way, I gotta mention, is not for kids whatsoever. It is an extremely hard R-rated movie. It's Ryan Reynolds' passion project. He's been trying to get it made for over 11 years. He plays a character called Wade Wilson, who uh, who's a former special operative uh, turned mercenary, special forces turned mercenary, who undergo uh, gets diagnosed with terminal cancer, undergoes a special experiment that leaves him with incredible healing powers, and he becomes essentially the character called Deadpool. It is extremely fun, so much fun to watch. The comedy hits at every moment. It's one of the funniest movies I've seen in years. The action really? is unbelievably incredible to watch. Wow. Ryan Reynolds is so good in the movie. I gave it a four and a half out of five. I've seen it three times. I just saw it for a third time seven hours ago. That's how much I love this You're movie. You're a dead Ryan Reynolds is <laughs> yeah, he was born. And this, this movie takes place in the X Men universe. So the character exists in the same world as Wolverine okay. and Professor X. So it's not for kids whatsoever. Okay, we Very R rated. That. I spoke to Ryan Reynolds and uh, TJ Miller about the movie, about how Deadpool's mask works in the movie, but also we were throwing darts at a Wolverine picture. Check this out. Yes, you're always hearing me speak through the mask. It's weirdly enough that there was a lot of bittersweet happenstance with the mask. It's uncomfortable, but at the same time, it was like really functional. You could hear everything perfectly. I could emote through it. It was. Uh, we just kind of got lucky there. The, the the eyes are really subtly animated, actually. They're really. They're just. And what they do is they film my face doing every line and every expression that I would make, and they take my eyes and actually map them onto the suit. Dude, he's such a good improviser. His background yeah. is in improvisation. Hit it! And, uh, oh, God, nice that was one. terrible. That was, that was yeah, Kevin, you got the board oh, on Scott here. Oh, oh, for a journalist. Looks like a great there, movie. There is an ending... Yeah, there's an ending credit scene, so make sure you stay through the ending credits. There's two extra scenes at the end of the movie, at the end mm -hmm. credits, just so Spe you know. Speaking of two, Zoolander 2 is out. Uh, you didn't like this. Yeah. Unfortunately, this movie is one of the worst comedies I've seen in a long time. I mean, I, I found myself bored beyond belief. All it is is celebrity cameo after celebrity cameo after celebrity cameo. Justin Bieber's in the film. The film, it's I love, love Zoolander 1 so much. This is one of the most disappointing sequels I've ever seen. Wow. And I found myself confused by the plot line. I didn't understand what was going on. It was beyond belief, so painful. I will say this on a positive note. I thought Will Ferrell and Kristen Wiig did a good job in their roles, but overall, I gave it a one and a half out of five. I say just skip the movie altogether. Not worth your money. Just okay. stay home, watch the original film yeah, on DVD well, or at least, Kevin, at least make the blue steel face, will you? Here we go. Ready for it? Here we go, here we go, here we go. Oh, my God. Wow. Is that good? Can, can, you, can you guys give me one? Can you, I, I think you got to suck your, your cheeks in more. Brian Which may one? have the best one, actually. Just give me a second. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> we get paid to do this, by the way. <laughs> this is our jobs. No. <laughs> this is awesome. I can't, I can't no. handle this. Um, that was very good. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Okay. Sue Brian. Thanks a lot. <laughs> All right, well, Kevin, thank, thank you. you. Um, I'll tell you what, they can't promote it anymore. <laughs> that, 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 he's, been, uh, he's been everywhere. Yep, but well, apparently not a good movie. All right, <laughs> don't go away. Don't go away it's just because he made that face. It's a big Friday. Geraldo Rivera and Judge Jeanine Pirro are here, and they're on their way in right now. Talk about a blue steel face. Let's see it, Geraldo. <laughs> <laughs>